So just to start off, my name is Daniela. I'm 25 years old and I'm currently living in uh, downtown Toronto. I work at a software company and so uh, to talk a little bit about how COVID-19 has impacted my life, um, I would start out by saying we've had to transition to a working from home environment. The way that this has affected me and some of the obstacles that I'm currently facing are, you know, staying motivated with work, ensuring that I'm maintaining a regular schedule, make sure I'm working out, eating properly. So a lot of these different things are now factoring into this extended uh, period of time that we're having to, you know, work independently and not have our team to necessarily rely on the same way we were before. Uh, the emotions I've been experiencing uh, really vary all over the map. Some days I feel um, super good. Usually if I go out for groceries or to get out and walk, uh, in those moments I'll oftentimes feel a little bit of stress and anxiety just about the entire situation, um, potentially getting sick. So it's definitely changed the way I look at uh, going outside, maybe going for a run, things like that. Um, what I would miss the most about not being physically present with other people certainly is just social interaction. I feel like these Zoom meetings, um, they're, while they're great, they're just simply not the same as working in an office space, having my coworkers right there, my managers um, to ask questions, to get help from. So that's definitely been extremely challenging and some of the ways that I'm motivating myself through this entire, you know, pandemic experience is, you know, leaning on other people uh, who are in similar situations who work with me, um, just kind of asking them what's, you know, making the days easier, what's helping them to stay away from feeling anxious. Uh, definitely some opportunities that I've found and ways I've been able to grow is through this entire experience, I've had to really push myself uh, to do better, you know, in my job, to do better managing my emotions. So all of those, you know, different feelings I've been experiencing, maybe I didn't have those before. So I've definitely gotten better at keeping uh, those negative thoughts at bay. I would say the biggest lesson I've learned through self-reflection is that, um, you know, when the going gets tough, then... I need to get going so when I knew that we would have to transition into this a uh, different way of life I had to find ways to still meet my goals stay on top of things not slack because I have the liberty of waking up and being in my office so I would definitely say uh, to everyone who's still going to be in this situation I know we're not going back until at least July 1st just keep on uh, staying positive there's you know, not much else we can do other than lean on our support systems and just keep doing our best uh, to kind of ride this wave.